Hello everyone, my name is Svetlana Mucha, I am the leading matchmaker and dating coach at Diola.com. Greetings from Stary Saltov, a small town resort not far from Kharkov, Ukraine. Today I would like to answer a question that we have received in the comments below one of our videos. And basically we will speak about the age gap and the chance to date a Ukrainian lady in her early 20s, someone from 20 up to 25 years. And is it possible to meet such a girl in Ukraine? I will read you the comment, the question, and then I will share my opinion. So basically the gentleman is asking, what success rate you have with girls with age range between 19 till 26? One common scene, I noticed almost all agency testimonials filled with older age uh, group members, like lady age 35 and men around 45 plus, even up upon 60. I see many young girls enrolled in many agencies, but never see them engaged. It's strange. There could be a few younger ones, but it's less than 1%. This uh, creates lots of doubts about foreign dating younger Ukrainian girls. So let me address this comment first. Uh, we have even filmed a testimonial of a younger couple, a lady is in her 20s and a gentleman is in his 30s. Yes, the girl uh, from that couple, she was 26 or 27 when she got engaged and the gentleman was 32 or 33, so she was not 21. I have already told in many of our videos that at Dealer.com we work uh, with a clientele, both male and female, from different age groups and within the last several years our male clients really got younger, so now the average age of our male clients is about 32 years old, while uh, six, seven years ago it was about 45 years. Uh, it doesn't mean though that we don't take older clients. Uh, our male client who is 70 years old recently got engaged, actually he got engaged during the lockdown, so love can compete even the lockdown. But yes, the majority of our male clients are either in the early 30s or in the late 20s and we are happy to work with such clients. So of course for such gentlemen we recruit ladies into our base who match their age. So of course I can't introduce a gentleman who is 28 years old to a lady who is like 38 or 45 years old. This would be ridiculous and neither a man or a lady would be interested in such an acquaintance. Anyway, I will really quickly uh, comment on uh, dating sites and uh, why they have many ladies in the age group 19 till uh, 26. I have already spoken in many uh, videos that I'm not fond of paper letter dating sites because first of all, think about yourself when you were 19 or 20 or 21. Were you interested in marriage? Did you want to get married and to have babies? Was it even on your radar? I doubt it. Probably you were very busy uh, being in the university, being a college student, getting ready to your exams, going to parties with all the college crowd, uh, dreaming about traveling the world. Uh, many things. And if you will tell me right now that, oh, girls are more mature. Guys, it's still the same. When she is 19, she doesn't want to get married and to have your babies yet. She's not thinking about marriage. Possibly, uh, yes, uh, maybe in five, 10 years, she would like that. But when she is 19, just like you were when you were 19, she is not dreaming about family yet. She's too young for that. And in Ukraine, girls uh, 19, 20, 21, up to 25, in the majority of cases, they still live with their parents. If you are talking about someone from the big city and from a small town as well, she is still living with her parents and uh, uh, people, if they study in the same city, they usually do not move uh, to the dormitory to live there and to live to campus. They go to college, to university from the apartment, from the house where they still live with their parents. Why do they register at paper letter dating sites? I don't know, maybe to get free photo shots uh, because if you are a Ukrainian girl, regardless of your age uh, on Instagram, you will receive tons of spam messages that, hey, this is a marriage agency. I don't know why they are calling this a marriage agency. This has nothing to do, absolutely nothing to do with marriage. And they promise you a free photo shoot in exchange uh, of your permission to use your photos. I have no idea why 19 and 20 years old register at paper letter dating sites. But the reality is 19, 20, 21 years old girls, marriage is not on their list of sins, in their top five of list of sins that they want. 
It's reality. Does it mean, though, uh, that you can't build a relationship with a girl who is 19, 20, 21, 22 from Ukraine? Actually, I will read uh, the second part of the question that we have received in the comment below this video, and I will answer this one to you. So, the gentleman writes, uh, My age is 34, and I demand girls between 21 and 25. Do you give me any assurance about finding multiple girls in that age range? When you already admitted girls in younger age more prefer about working and becoming independent, right? Uh, here you have to uh, divide these questions into two parts. First one, he is 34 and he wants to date someone who is 10 years younger, so he is looking for a big age gap. So the question is not about if the girl who is 21 or 22 is seeking for a relationship. It is if the girl who is 21 or 22 is ready to date someone who is 12 years older. The answer is no, she is not ready and she won't be interested. And even if you will get the date by being 34 with a girl who is 21 or 22, the chances that you will build a relationship there are like that small. Why? Because at 34 you already have some life experience. Probably you got your education already, you had multiple jobs, probably you have managed to build a career, you've been into a relationship, maybe you did some traveling. You are 34, so from the moment you have graduated from the university till now, it has been about 12 years, so you have lived a little. She, if she is 21 or 22, she is on her last year in the university. She probably lives with her parents and she never had a job, so she has never earned her own money. Yes, she has dated boys her age in her university, maybe in high school, so her relationship experience and life experience will be very limited. And this age gap of 12 years between of you, it would be enormous. So you would be on such a different page about many things. Well, for example, you at 34 can be craving to have a family, to have kids, to settle down in a house with a white fence. She at 21 can dream about surfing in Thailand, uh, building a career in Silicon Valley, becoming a super popular designer, photographer, many things. Having kids and getting married and sitting at home when she is just 21 won't be on her radar. Now, if we are talking about a possibility to date a Ukrainian girl who is 21 and 22, is it possible? It is possible if you are 21, 22, 24, 25. Up till 26 years old, if you are 26 or 25, you can attract a girl who is 21 or 22 and you would be on the same page about many things. Your long-term goals will align and you will have more in common than a gentleman who is 34. If you are speaking about the age gap of 12 years when the lady is 42 and the gentleman is, for example, 54, then this age gap won't have such a strong influence on your relationship because both of uh, you would be adults with some life experience and you were in the same roles, like probably you were students, then you were employees or employers, probably you were parents, you were partners. You will have more in common, but if we are speaking about 21 and 34 and even about 24 and 34, the age gap would be too big. Of course, you can tell me right now that you know a couple and the girl is 21 and the gentleman is 34. I don't know about that couple. There might be exceptions like Catherine Zeta-Jones and Michael Douglas. Their age gap is 25 years and they are still together. It works for them. Does it mean that it will work for any other people? Probably not. They are exceptional. Such relationships are exceptional. I don't know the gentleman that is 34 years old who has uh, written this uh, comment asking this question about dating a girl from 19 up till 26. I haven't spoken to you, but uh, judging on your question, I would say that no, it wouldn't be possible and probably we won't be taking you as a client if you want to date someone in early 20s uh, by being 34. We work right now with several clients who are in their late 20s and early 30s and we individually discuss which age group they should consider and why. For example, I have a client who is 31 and he's a young accomplished uh, businessman and uh, actually he speaks Russian because his parents are from Ukraine and they have relocated to the United States and he is very smart, he is mature for his age uh, because in his situation uh, after his 
father has passed away, unfortunately had to take the business over. So when we were discussing the age group of ladies uh, that I would recommend him to date, um, I would say that I wouldn't go below 25. Why? Because those ladies, they won't have the same level of maturity. They won't be able to appreciate him truly because they simply didn't have time to uh, grow uh, as a person and to get that maturity. They can be an exceptional 24, 23 years old who can have that maturity. And usually these are the girls that have started working very early. For example, uh, if the girl has started her modeling career when she was 16 and she has retired from it uh, when she turned 22, I'm talking right now about real models who walk the catwalks in Paris and uh, that's a very demanding work. Uh, I have worked with such lady. Uh, but if we are speaking about uh, the average girl who is 21, 22, she is still in the university. She doesn't know how to earn money and she is financially dependent on her parents. And in many cases, you will be involved not only in relationship with her, but also in relationship with her family. I will tell you a story really quickly. Uh, my neighbors and they are in their 40s, uh, a nice couple, they have a daughter. She is 20 years old and uh, she is a student in the university. She studies finance and she has met her first boyfriend. He's also 20 years old, they go to the same university and he also studies finance and they were dating for about four or five months and then this uh, young couple uh, has decided to go on a vacation together. And of course, the family of the girl was not happy about it. They have demanded to meet the family of the boy uh, and while well, they have met, they have decided that, uh, okay, kids want to go on a vacation, they want to ski together, then we will all go together. So the family of this 20 years old girl and the family of this 20 years old boy, uh, all the parents, they have gathered together and went to the ski resort together so that the kids can spend the time together and the parents can spend the time together. 20, 21, they are still kids. Uh, even if they can look grown up, uh, even they can try to act grown up and don't try to tell me right now that girls are more mature than boys. What were you thinking about when you were 20 years old? What were your dreams? What were your aspirations? And when you were 21, why weren't you thinking about marriage when you were 20 or 21? If you wanted to marry someone who is 20 or 21, you should have done it when you were 20 or 21. I'm sorry, but now when you are 34, that's too late to date someone who is 20 or 21. It won't work. Your goals would be very different. I can tell you right now really quickly about the gentleman with whom we have worked about eight years ago or nine years ago, I think. Uh, he was 24 when we have just started working with him. And actually our services were a gift of his parents to him. He couldn't afford a matchmaker back then. And we have introduced him to a girl who was 22, two years younger. She was on her last year in the university. And uh, this couple, they have dated for about two years before he proposed to her. Then they were engaged, it was a long engagement, for almost two years. And finally, after that, they got married. And uh, they have lived in the US, and then they have lived in India because both of them were fond of surfing and uh, yoga. So they went to India, to Thailand, to the East. and. Uh, eight or nine years after now I follow them on Instagram, uh, they have returned back to the US uh, and she is pregnant right now. So when she was 22, uh, she wanted to have a boyfriend and uh, her boyfriend then he wanted to have a girlfriend, a special girlfriend. But they were not really interested in having babies back then in their early 20s. Uh, now after spending this time together, after growing together, uh, they both feel ready. And the work with gentlemen who are like 25, 26, 27, they can succeed with dating someone who is 22, 21, especially those guys who work in IT. We have many clients from the Silicon Valley. And of course, if he is 25, uh, the age group that he will consider would be from 20 and up till 25. And they will have much in common, but at 34, uh, girls will consider you old. If she is 21, she will consider you old and she will feel that you are old, even if you look great. I'm sorry, but that's reality. Guys, I hope it was helpful for you and I hope that, that 
motorboat uh, hasn't messed up much with the sound yet. I wish you love. Svetlana Muha from Diola.com with love.